How to use Calipeg Mini on your iPhone to flip your animation on your iPad. First of all, be sure to update Calipeg on your iPad and Calipeg Mini on your iPhone to get the latest features. On Calipeg on iPad, just go to the settings here in the remote tab, then activate the remote. After you enabled the Bluetooth permission for Calipeg, it will look for nearby devices. On Calipeg Mini, tap on the settings here in the remote tab, enable Bluetooth detection. And now Calipeg Mini is available here. Of course, I can choose another name for the device within Calipeg Mini. Just tap on Connect. And now Calipeg Mini on your iPhone can be used as a remote. Here I'm flipping on the frames. I can decide to flip on the sheets or on the markers if there is some. I personally prefer to flip on sheets. That here is a linear flip. You can tap here and then go to the circular flip, which can be used from anywhere on the surface. You can decide the sensitivity of the flip. You can activate the loop mode here. So you can flip all round from beginning to end and then back. And that here is the third option, which is the remote. So you can play and pause, add a new sheet, which is the equivalent of here. Go to before and after frames, sheets or markers. Go to the first frame or to the last frame, which in my situation are the same because it's a loop. And then if you want to disconnect, you can tap here and exit the remote or go back in the settings in the remote and disconnect. And now Calipeg Mini is back to the studio where you can use it as a complete 2D animation tool. You can try Calipeg on your iPad for free for 7 days and then it's either a subscription or a one-time purchase. And Calipeg Mini is available on your iPhone App Store for a tiny price just once.